Hi, everybody. Welcome to Pittsburgh. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. The Penguins are in the driver's seat and can really put the squeeze here tonight with a win. Each step you can take along the way is another nail in the coffin. They want to put one more in tonight. And we are about set to drop the puck tonight. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. Puts it up front. From the slot, wrist shot, and that one's blocked. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. Hooking the call and maybe a little sell job along the way? A little bit, but the player's got to move his feet. As soon as you stop, if it's even close, you're going to get now. New York's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Well, James, statistically, we know that you score the first goal of the game, you're going to win well over 55% of the time. So that first goal is critical. Now you've got a great chance because you're on the power play. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. The Islanders have it in the offensive zone. Takes the shot. A chance. And there's the save. Gets it out of his own end. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Quick feed to Beauvillier. And he makes the save. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Still no score in this one. Pittsburgh's got a hold of the puck. Rust's got it in the defensive end. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. Barzell's got it against the boards. Coughs it up on the play. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And they do just that. Oh, I thought they did a pretty good job there, James. That's a time you can get yourself running around in the zone. They didn't get there. New York's got the puck along the boards. Moves it to Lee. The Islanders take it across the blue line. And as both teams are now back at even strength, the power play goes over on the opportunity. Made the stop on that play. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. And he comes up with it. New York's got the puck in their own end. The Penguins win the draw. The Islanders have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Pittsburgh's gained possession along the boards. The Penguins played along the wing. Here he is in front. Scores! No chance for the puck stopper on that one. If you can work yourself in that close to the net and then get loose, man, you're just hoping somebody can find you. He one times that for a goal. Pittsburgh's got the home crowd right back into it here in the first five minutes. I love the way that they approach this game. They weren't going to hold back at all, and now they can play from the lead. Scored by number 59. Sends a pass over. By number 87. Puck grabbed by Kapanen. Couldn't connect on that pass. The Islanders are in transition. Time of the goal. Three minutes, 19. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. Pokes it away in his own end. New York's moving it up the ice. Move to the middle. And just out of arm's reach on the play. Good battle along the boards for the puck. The Islanders have it against the wall. With the stop. Crosby's been on fire lately. His point streak's starting to stretch out. This is when you feel like you'll score any game. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. 
We got a one nothing game to this point. The Islanders will go to work here in the offensive zone. Puck scooped up by Beauvillier. Scores! We're all evened up! It's amazing, isn't it? We played this time, and now it doesn't matter. It's like we're right back at the beginning again. That's a big goal. He's tight to the net. He doesn't have much time. And that snapshot beats the goaltender from the low slot. The Penguins win the draw here in the neutral zone. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. On the backhand! Big save in front! Still lots of time left here in this frame. We are all tied up in this one. Off the draw and he ties up his opponent. Now he takes it over the line. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it against the wall. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Manages to hang on. Stones him in front. New York's got the puck along the wall. Now a quick pass to Bailey. And it's a quick pass to Beauvillier. The Islanders move to the offensive zone. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. Moves it quickly over to Beauvillier. Here's a chance right in front. Shot. Scores! Quickly, two goals in right around 90 seconds. That sure changes things here on the ice. Yeah, the game has completely been turned upside down. Goalie gets a little bit of this. Almost beat cleanly, but it's not going to matter. It's in the net anyway. The Islanders continue to lead here by one in the first. This is a good start for them. They've got the early goal, and teams love to play from ahead. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Here's a short pass to Pedersen. That pass doesn't go. Handles the puck. The blocker saved by Varlamov. making that save in road hockey the old blocker stop puck possession so critical another face off coming up here the penguins win it sends the pass over and too much traffic in front blocks that one quick pass to Malkin puck picked up by Rust offside is the call and we'll have a face off just outside the offensive zone Plenty of playing time left in this frame. The Islanders are looking to build on this one-goal lead. Barzell's won the draw here in the neutral zone. And he handles a cross-ice pass. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. And now he moves it to Zucker. The Penguins move the puck in the defensive zone. Scrum along the boards. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. It's a two-on-one. Sends it over. Scores! Matthew Barzell! No way sometimes for the goalie to catch up to the pass. It's too quick. It's one-timed into the net.
defender's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. And that one's turned away. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. New York's won the draw. The Islanders have it now. Quick feed to Clutterbuck. Loses his balance on the play. Loose puck battle along the boards. Right in front with the shot. They score! James, how many timeouts can you have? Because they need one now. They needed one before. And the way this is going, they're going to need one in a few minutes. Or they could use the ghost of Roger Nielsen to wave that white towel. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Nearing the midway mark of the period. The Islanders have taken control of this one, now leading by three. The Penguins win possession here in the open ice. New York's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. The Islanders play it along the boards. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Angles it over to Tanev. Wax it into the offensive zone. The Islanders will play the puck from behind the net. Quick feed to Komarov. New York's on the attack. Can't catch up to the pass. Nelson's got it along the wing. Nice pass. The Penguins in transition at center. The Islanders have it from their own end. Komarov's taking it from his own end. Moves it to Bailey. Through center. Tries to get it to Nelson. Moves it quickly over to Sevier. Tosses it to Jankowski. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Wrist one. Turned aside with a glove by Barlama. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. Past the midway mark in this period. It's a 4-1 game. The Penguins win the faceoff. And he takes a shot. Quick stop by Varlamov. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. The Islanders will play it from the defensive zone. And now he passes it to Pacho. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Here's a short pass to Jankowski. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the boards. Rips it on net. Too many bodies in the way. Stays with it. Trying to get back on the attack now. Pass back to the point. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. New York's in transition. Pittsburgh's gained possession. That's moved up ahead. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. Pittsburgh's looking to break out of their own end. Across the line from center. Works it across to Everly. They've got the defense outnumbered. Snaps one from the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, he flares up the arm with the blocker. Makes a pretty good save here. The centermen glide into position. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Picked up along the wall by Gensel. Nice zone entry from the middle. To his teammate. Big time defensive play. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Quick pass to Zucker. Takes the feed. Feeds the puck to Kapanen. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. Oh, what a blocker stop by Varlamov. And a smart heads-up read to come up with the puck. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. And now it's grabbed by Matheson. The Penguins move it ahead. The Islanders take possession in the neutral zone. Snaps one here in the slot. Denies him in close. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. 
I wanted to look at this again to show you how the goaltender tracks the puck across the front of the net on the play to make the save. Past the halfway mark of this period, the Islanders are giving their fans a lot to cheer about tonight as they lead it 4-1. The Penguins win the draw. Pittsburgh's got the puck in the defensive end. Quick feed to Malkin. Takes the puck at the point. And that shot dies in traffic. The Islanders take it along the wing. And they fail to go tape to tape. Uses the force on that hit. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Nelson's moving it ahead. That's dumped in and they'll get a fresh group of forwards out there. Takes the feed. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Picked up along the boards by Letty. Carries the puck inside the neutral zone. Nothing doing on that. The Penguins take possession in the defensive end. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Taken by Pulak. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Nice poke check. Moves it to Sisikis. How do you miss that, Ray? I don't know, but we all do. You're right in a scoring zone, and you don't even test the goalie. Grabbed along the board by Gensel. From the neutral zone, moving forward here along the boards. And they'll dump it in. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. New York's got control of it now from their own end. Puck battle along the boards. The Penguins gain possession along the wall. New York's got the puck. Pittsburgh's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Taken along the wall by Pellick. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Moves it quickly over to Gensel. Couldn't make that one happen. And that pass goes awry. Moves the puck to Pellick. Here's a short pass to Sezikis. Receives the pass. And he denied that opportunity. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Moves the puck along the half wall. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. The Islanders take it across the line. Tried to make a move and the puck hops away. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Sends it in deep. The Penguins have it against the wall. Sevier's lugging the puck. Can't hang on after that hit. Quick pass to Del Cole. Dead eyes up on the play. You don't want to give up too many of these during the course of the game. The odd man rush puts the goalie on alert, but he makes a good stop. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. A howitzer, and that's blocked! And there's the horn, mercifully bringing this first period to an end. Fans, tonight, the home team bluff is dropping $50 gift certificates to Delman. Proud sponsor of tonight's game, with 70 stores and 14 restaurants, Delman's has it all. Two more periods still to come. We'll be right back with much more action here on EA Sports. James Slavowski, Ray Ferraro bringing you all the action. Period number two is about to go. Period number two underway here. It's been an absolute mismatch through the first 20 minutes. Strong defensive effort. Puck grab by Lee. Hunks the boards through the neutral zone. Quick feed to Kapanen. Gains the zone through center. Jabs the puck away. And now it's grabbed by Pellick. Dishes it to Pollock. Tries to get the puck over to Barzell. Maintains possession. New York's got it along the wall and couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Off target! Pittsburgh's gained possession along the boards. New York's got it now. Knocked away. Scored.
Scooped up along the wall by Latang. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Dumoulin swinging the puck through center ice. Dishes it to Latang. Cutting to the slot. Here he is on the backhand. That's wide of the net. You can go games without a chance from here. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Excellent stick work on the play. There's a whistle as the officials calling for a penalty here. We got a minor penalty coming up for here. Sure, on this one. James. I mean, this call was going to be made. You could see the play develop, and now they're going to have to serve two minutes. Our first look tonight at their power play unit. You can set a special team trend if your first power play is a positive one. Get some shots, get some pressure. Kapanen's on the attack in the offensive zone. Couldn't complete the play. Puck scooped up by Mayfield. Manages to hang on. New York's got a chance to work the transition game now shorthanded. And they manage to clear it. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it against the wall. Nice zone entry on the left side. Here's the chance to clear the puck from his own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. Great pressure forcing the turnover. New York's blowing their opponent out of this game. They've intercepted so many passes, it's like they've played a perfect game. Slides the puck down low. Gives them nothing in front. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. Dead center, excellent save. And now he tries to get it across to Latang. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. And he comes up with it. Zucker's gaining momentum. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the half wall. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Here's the chance. Oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Battle along the boards. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. Here they come up along the wing. Slides it across, and that one's broken up. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. They've got numbers, and now he moves it quickly to Del Cole. Stop that one. Here's a blast. Denies him again. Denies him. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. Rust's going off for hooking. I guess at a certain point you got to let the guy go, but he worries that he's out of position, so he tries to slow him down with a hook. Pretty cut and dry call. Another power play opportunity coming up here. The coaches have been on these guys to get more traffic in front of the goaltender. We'll see if they can do it. The Islanders take possession off the faceoff. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Battling for it along the boards. And he regains control of the puck. Sends it quickly to pull up. Takes the feet at the back end. Moves it to Lee. And that's broken up. Pittsburgh's got it against the boards. Moves it around along the half wall. Jostled off the puck. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. They got to do a better job entering the zone here. They don't have a shot on net, and it's turning into a conditioning drill. They're going back and forth up and down the ice. His reflexes on display tonight. Oh, he almost put him through the boards. Snaps it on net. Close save, and he handles it with ease. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Wow, did that sound like it hurts. You crash somebody against the boards like that, and there is nowhere to go. The Islanders lead in a big way here in this second. They have been on fire offensively. Moves the puck. Gets in front of it. Latang's got the puck in his own zone. Slides it up ahead from the right wing. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Big chest save as he gobbled that one up with the trapper. Still lots of time left in the period. 4-1 is where we sit. A pretty one-sided affair. Off the draw and a nice job locking up his opponent. 
It doesn't really matter that the power play didn't score. They've got such a nice lead. But I'll tell you, as a guy that made a living on the power play, I wanted to score every time I was out there. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Another stop by the goaltender. Nice work in there. After the first stop, he's got to find the puck to save the second. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Scrum ensues along the boards. Takes control of the puck. Up along the wing. Pass it up ahead. From the back of the cage with the puck. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Pullock. Move to the middle. He was right there and they can't convert. Getzel's got it across the line. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. On the attack along the boards. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Kapanen's picking up steam. Centering pass. And that one's broken up. Pellick stick handling in his own zone. Sasikas plays it along the wall. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. Slides the puck across to McCann. A shot completely misses on the play. You don't even make the goalie work here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Denies him! He's got to work hard to find the puck through all the bodies right in front of him. Move to the middle! Puts another on the net! He gets that one, too! Really sharp. Never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. And he slides it quickly to Letty. Takes the pass. And look at this, a three-on-one. Comes up with the stop. Barlamov's goaltending at one end and the offensive output at the other has made for a good night. That's a pretty good scoring chance. That's a chance the shooter thinks might go in, but the goalie turns it aside. The Islanders have been on fire offensively tonight, and they lead for good reason here in the second. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. And now he angles it across to Lee. Puck picked up by Letty. The Penguins have it against the wall. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Nice zone entry from the left. The Penguins gain control of it. Pittsburgh's got it in the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Pajo. With possession along the wall. The Penguins get a hold of the puck along the boards. Here they come. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Big save by the goaltender once again. After the first stop, he's in good position to make a second. Oh, they moved the puck really well on that odd man break. But the goaltender was right on it to make the stop. The Islanders have been the better team, leading in the shot department, and they lead it on the scoreboard. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. Pokes the puck away. Sends it out right in front, and a stick in the lane ends that threat. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Pedersen's got it in the offensive end. Big play inside the defensive zone. That opportunity is rejected. From the left side, they gain the zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Denies him in front. Sometimes you're in close. There's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Big stop by the keeper. Scrum along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Pittsburgh's got a hold of the puck. And he slides it quickly to Ruedel. Passes over to Malkin. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. From in close. Oh, and a little too much air on that one. He's trying to shoot that right next to the goalie's ears. Get it up top, but he shoots it too high. Del Cole's got the puck. Gets a stick on it to make the save. That's a dangerous scoring chance, but the goaltender makes a great save as he's able to snuff it out. The Islanders have to be feeling good about themselves here in the late stages of this second period as they continue to lead big. 
New York's got it in the offensive zone. Big save. Getting into the later stages of this period, the Islanders lead at 4-1. Offense is on face-off, and he wins the draw. That's blocked. Denied by the goaltender. New York's up for good reason. They have been the more complete team offensively, which is why they lead late in the second. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. New York's gained possession along the boards. Taken by Latang. The Penguins are on the attack. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. The setters will glide into the dot. The Penguins win the draw. Knocked away. And now it's over to Sevier. Gobbles the puck up there with a the chest. And we're going to get a whistle here. And a solid job tying up his opponent. New York's got it in their own zone. Dumps it in. Pittsburgh's got it from behind the net. And now he moves it to Latang. With some open space at center. Picked up along the wall by Nelson. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Sends it across. Stopped by the goaltender. Picked up along the boards by Dumoulin. The Penguins take it along the wall. Couldn't complete the play. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Let's it go. On the redirect. And a strong effort on that play. Now over to Bailey. It's a three on one. Here's the pass. Booming shot. And that banks off a stick. He was locked in there. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Ties him up, and it didn't go unnoticed in the eyes of the officials here. Here's the official call. Bailey's going off to the box for two minutes. There's certain plays, as soon as they happen, the red flag goes up for the official. Stick goes across the player's waist. He's looking for hooking. The game has become better since they've cracked down on obstruction, Ray. Power play unit going back to work. Sometimes you have to have the shortest of memories when you play on a specialty unit like the power play. It hasn't gone very well for them so far tonight. They have to attack this power play with a renewed vigor. Here's a short pass to Gensel. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Pushes it across to Sezikis. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Dumps it in. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it against the wall. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Here's a shot. Oh, couldn't finish the job. What an excellent opportunity, Ray. They worked their way into good shape. He's just not able to beat the goalie. And the period has come to an end in what has been a very one-sided affair tonight. Hey, hockey fans, follow the team all through the world on the radio for every minute of play-by-play -play action, both home and away. Or listen to the What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. The moment of truth has arrived for both these teams. Third period action set to go. The Penguins win possession here as we open up the period, and that power play is still intact. Couldn't find the intended target. Quick pass to Gensel. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. Quick feed to Latang. 
Passes the puck over to Crosby. Good use of the body on the play. Stopped by the goaltender. The Islanders get their man back. We're back to even strength. Always frustrating for the power play when they go back to the bench and don't have anything to show for it. New York's offense has been a thing to watch tonight as they lead it big time here early in the third. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Oh, if there's going to be a regret in this one, that might be it. Yeah, that play is right there to be had. They just missed the pass. The scoring chance goes away. Moves it to Crosby. Right in the slot. Here he is in front. Denies him with the blocker. What a stop by Harlemov. The Islanders have been the more active squad offensively tonight, and they lead it early in this third period. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. Puts the puck on net, way off target. From the place 99 made famous. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Slides the puck across to Everly. Passes right to the front. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. And he's ridden off the puck. McCann's got it in the defensive end. Along the right side into the offensive zone. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Still plenty of time left in this frame. A lot of offense in this one, mostly from one side. We've got 4-1 the score. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Passes on over to Pacho. The Islanders take it across the blue line. And the puck departs the zone. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. Slides the puck over. Stops him with a glove. New York's been a dominant force offensively. Plenty of quality scoring opportunities, and they lead it big time early in the third. Puck grab by Zucker. Gaining momentum along the boards. New York's regained possession of the puck. They'll change things up on the back end as that's in and deep. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Moves it over to Rust. Now a quick pass to Zucker. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Grabbed along the boards by Boychuk. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. The Penguins get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Sends a pass over. Made the stop on the play. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Slides it back to the blue line. The Islanders have it against the wall. Tangles him up with the stick, and the officials are all over it. The Penguins have been called for hooking. Once he puts up his little token argument here, he's going to circle around a bit and try and regroup here as he goes to the penalty box. Were you box. a haggler? Always. You never think it's the right call. New York's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. When you don't get many power plays, you really have to make them count. One goal can be a big difference maker. On the doorstep. Moves it quickly over to Everly. Oh, that's a smart heads-up play as he breaks it up with the poke. New York's got it behind the net. Sends it ahead to Everly. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Here's a short pass to Everly. Pokes it away in his own end. Pittsburgh's looking to break out. And it's a quick pass to Jankowski. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Redirected in front. Great save by the goaltender. Just real smart positioning on that one. Here's a shot. Comes up with the stop. New York's moving it up the ice. Taken along the wall by Lee. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. And now he tries to get it across to McCann. New York's grabbed a hold of the puck. 
I don't believe the coaches are going to be too worried about this. They didn't score on the power play, but I think it's most important that they didn't give anything up. They've got such a nice lead. The coaches are more focused on making sure this game plays out comfortably. Quick pass to Letty. New York's got it along the wall. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it against the wall. Mulkins moving the puck through his own zone. Deflected away. Knight trying to shake off the defender. Denies him on the breakaway. Really good speed to get out in front. Dust the pack. Now it's him and the goalie. But the goalie's better. He makes the stop. And now it's grabbed by Pulak. Made that stop. Pretty good shot. The goalie's able to get the blocker up on it and put it outside. New York's laying a pounding on the opposition tonight, generating numerous scoring chances and converting on what feels like almost all of them. Pajot's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. Takes it across the blue line. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. Taken by Del Cole. Into the attacking area from the left side. Puck battle along the boards. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. Quick feed to Gensel. Fails to find the open man. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. No, you're not going to get away with that one right in front of the official. Delayed penalty coming up. It's a tripping, it looks like. Uh, you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. Another chance here on the man advantage. I like this. They got together right before the faceoff and discussed a couple of options. They haven't had a lot of opportunities tonight. Puts it to the front of the net. Moves it to Crosby. Oh, and another big stop. Clearing attempt. Call that a win for the penalty killers on that one. Yeah, he slams it off the glass. Now the power play's got to go back to get set up. Crosby's got the puck along the wing. Moves it quickly over to Gensel. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Back to the point it goes. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Smothered that in close chance. Save made by the goalie. Moves inside. And a penalty coming up here as the officials all over that as they saw him slow him up. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. The Islanders have been handed two minutes for hooking. Like every player in the history of the game, he doesn't like the call, but he's going to have to go serve his minor penalty. The Penguins could really open things up with a five-on-three power play. Well, here's a key point in the game, a five-on-three power play. You don't get too many of these. You really want to cash in. Skates to the crease. Scooped up along the wall by Kapanen. Shot. Scores. On the man advantage. They took advantage of the extra time available with a manpower advantage, and they're on the board. The power play takes advantage of that extra man nicely. They move the puck around and set up a shot. But then they have traffic in front of the net, making the goaltender really work to see it. Pittsburgh still got to find two more goals, but they at least have one back. That gives them a little bit of hope, and the bench seems to have come alive a little bit. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. The to the low slide! By number 16, Jason. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Well past the midway mark of this period. Pittsburgh still behind the eight balls. They trail by two goals. The Penguins win the faceoff. Trying to clear the puck from his own end. And they get it down. That good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. They just clear it down the ice. 
And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Fires one. Too much congestion blocks the shot. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. The centermen glide into position. Steps in and takes the puck. Trying to get it out. And manages to clear the zone. The Penguins will play the puck from behind the net. Rust's got it along the boards. He's got a step. And he comes up with a big stop. I can't do it better than that, James. That's a great stop. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. And time expires on the power play. Both teams back to even. Well, back to even strength. The penalty killers do a really good job. They retain their lead on the backs of those four guys. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Puck dumped in. Pittsburgh's gained possession along the boards. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Nice poke check. Here's a short pass to Nelson. And he loses control of the puck. The Penguins have it now. New York's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Pittsburgh's got possession at center. Fires it into the offensive zone. New York's got the puck along the wall. And now it's grabbed by Mayfield. Pajot's picking up momentum through center. Not able to connect. Broken up at center. Dumps it into the O-zone. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. New York's looking to break out of their own end. Slides it over with pace to Latang. Huge steal in his own end. The Islanders have been in such good position all night long. Stick position is critical as they continue to intercept a lot of passes. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. We got a delayed penalty coming up here as the ref's hand goes up in the air. And the goaltender gets to the bench for the extra attacker. The arms up. There's the whistle. And boy, look at the time here for a penalty coming up. I saw the hold, did you? Yeah, so did 18,000 other people, so it's no surprise the ref got it as well. Centers glide into the face-off dot, and a huge five-on-three power play looms. And it's quite some time on the five-on-three. What a big advantage for them. They have to take advantage of this opportunity. You can't let a two-man advantage slip away. Nice save from point-blank range. Somehow the shooter got loose in the slot, but the goaltender's equal to the task. That's a good save. Look out! And he gets in the lane to block that. Takes a shot with the stop. The Islanders have been the busier team in the shot department, and they lead it late in this third period. Good job tangling up his opponent here. The Islanders have it in the offensive zone. Wow. He scores! Ah, the power play comes through. They move the puck nicely, and they're able to capitalize on the extra man. Play's job is to create shots and if you can create them from the most dangerous areas of the ice you're going to be successful dead center in the slot he doesn't miss the islanders have really been strutting their offensive prowess you've been impressed tonight i really have they can put it on cruise control now a large lead here in the third period. Puck scooped up by Letty. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Great stop by the goaltender off the glove. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Quick pass to McCann. Into the middle of the neutral zone. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. So often in a, in a shifty little play that you're trying to get to the puck, you get your stick in the wrong spot, he steps on your stick, and there's nothing you can do.
A little four-on-four -four hockey as both teams step inside the face-off circle. Each team playing with four men, and that means that you're going to have a defenseman jumping into the play. If they don't get a good chance, you know the other team will. Barzell's got it in the offensive zone. Quick snap. He scores! And a big one from there! That's a pretty critical goal in the playoffs here. It's his first ever. That's just a minute between goals. I think we can officially call this one a rout now. Yeah, this is a steamroll. This is over. A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. The Islanders haven't missed much tonight, Ray. No, they'd have to play really poorly to screw up this now. They have played outstanding hockey. Pittsburgh's got a hold of the puck off the draw. And the referee caught that trip on the play. We've got a delayed penalty coming up. Let's get the official decision. And tripping looks to be the call, Ray. Really a frustrating penalty to take because you're just fishing for the puck. You get your stick in the wrong spot. The guy goes down and you're toast every time. Here we go, a lengthy five on three power play looms. Hey, they say greed is good. Get one, get two on a five on three power play. Puck move back to center, forcing them to regroup. The Penguins gain possession along the wall. Looks to get the puck over to McCann. Picked off in the open ice. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And it's kicked away. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Here he is, all alone! I don't know what to describe that as. I can tell you, whatever he thought was going to happen, it wasn't that. They don't even get a shot. And the puck clears the zone. The Penguins have it behind the cage. Quick feed to Kapanen. The Penguins carry it along the wall. Takes a shot and makes a save. Again, the denial by the goaltender. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. And a successful clearing attempt. Moves it to Matheson. And that one stopped. Barlamov's been taking dangerous chances and throwing them to the curb all night. Here's another one. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Pittsburgh's won the draw. Handles the puck. Takes a shot. Stones him with the blocker. Off the one-timer. And another stop. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. New York's penalty killers get a hold of it. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Quick pass across to Crosby. Takes a shot. Oh, at the buzzer of big save. That's it. There's the final horn to close this one up. Deuce is wild in this series. Pretty much what we expected. Yeah, now you're getting into the part of the series, James, where it becomes a war of attrition. Guys are starting to get banged up. They're tired. The game's getting more and more intense. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us tonight.